The question is, who is the borrower of call money? The answer is banks. Banks are the borrowers of call money. Those banks which face the temporary shortage of funds. Basically, this call money is an interbank transaction amongst two banks. If one bank needs money, he borrows it from the other bank. This call money is repayable on demand. And generally, this money is arranged on calls. Whenever the banks need money, they call the other bank. And whenever they want the money back, still they call the same bank. Actually, what happens is the banks have to maintain the cash reserve ratio and the statutory liquidity ratio. What if their balance falls short of these ratios? In that case, to maintain that particular reserve, they have to borrow it from the other banks. Just because to satisfy the RBI needs, they have to maintain the CRR and SLR. As in when the banks need money, they borrow it from the other bank. This term is called call money. Now, a rise in call money rates make other sources of finance such as commercial paper and certificate of deposit cheaper in comparison for the other banks. So this is an interbank transaction amongst the two banks, repayable on demand, just the maximum of 1 to 15 days. I hope I have made it clear in less than two minutes what is the meaning of call money. Like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching. Stay safe. Stay blessed.